Today we're at an end terrace property, this one on the right, which is an off-market deal with one of our contacts. And it's currently a four bedroom end terrace uh, property, but it's ideally set up to be a five bed social HA. Now we're in the popular area of Duckenfield here and we are on a road here which is between Duckenfield and Hyde, so in the popular borough of Tameside. Now this property has a double extension, as you can see here, just going around the back. And the structure of the property is quite good. Now, this property will need a full refurbishment, as you'll see shortly, but it is really well set up for uh, a social housing association lease. Now I've been in contact with a social housing provider that we work with, Serco, in this area and usually they offer £65 per room per week but I've negotiated that this property will get £70 per room per week for five rooms. When we look at the bedrooms you'll see that they all exceed the 6.51 metres squared minimum size and they've got a front reception room which is really well set up. So we'll move into the property now. We've got a good size entrance hall and as you'll see as we walk around the property needs a full refurbishment but this front reception room here will very very easily be available to be created into a fifth bedroom. What we'll do is we put a wall up here and then that would be the fifth bedroom and I'll show you the other four bedrooms. Now what would be with this wall locked here I'll walk through this door and obviously um, we'll be changing all the doors to fire doors into the large rear reception room which goes into the rear yard into a good size long galley kitchen all of this will be taken out the boiler changed damp proof works fire safety doors fire system a, a, a major refurbishment to be carried out of this property but when you look at the numbers you'll see that the return on this property is fantastic so walking upstairs, we've got a layout of four bedrooms and a family bathroom. At the back, a bedroom here, as you can see, perfect size. You're looking for 6.51 as a minimum. Other things to point out, we have a balustrade here that needs changing. Coming into another room here, we can see that this again will be of good size for social housing, perfect in fact. And going down here, we have a family bathroom currently set up. All of this will be taken out and replaced into a modern family bathroom. And then moving to the front, we've probably got the small, with the front split into two bedrooms. We've probably got the smallest of two bedrooms here. Now I think this room is 6.51 meters squared, but I've got some of my colleagues here with me and they're going to be measuring the size of this room. Now, if for any reason this room here is not 6.51 meters squared, we'll borrow a bit of space from the room next door, which is much bigger than 6.51 meters squared. And as you can actually see, this room has got a stud wall, so it's nice and easy. So a summary of this property for you, and look at all of the photos and the numbers, is that this is perfectly set up for a five bedroom social housing uh, property. I've already contacted Serco and this area is applicable for social housing leases and as I said I have got uh, an uplift in the rate per room from £65 per week to £70 per week so this is an off-market deal. Now I'm expecting that the agreed price will be between £125,000 and £130,000 and you'll have to have a look uh, at the cost for the repairs. There are significant repairs, uh, as I mentioned, a new kitchen, new bathroom, uh, we need a new damp proof course, repairs to the render, there's quite a long list. But even with all of those repairs done, it's a fantastic return and we can set this up on a five year lease.